there is one final thing that we need to do on our prototype and that is to add the degree symbol. The degree symbol exists on the target temperature uh, when it first starts out because that's what we manually typed in. However, when we move our slider, the degree symbol disappears. That's because we created a formula that says that this target number should equal the uh, height or the y position of our slider um, and we did uh, calculations to get the range that we wanted. So let's go back into that formula and tweak it a little bit so that we can get that degree symbol back. Back in our project we can see that we have a detect trigger and that detects the Y position of the box slider so anytime that changes it's going to affect our text which is our target temperature and this text is going to be uh, determined by this formula and this formula um, just to review it gives us the distance of the slider to the bottom of the screen the bottom of the screen screen is 812 points as we just take that minus the y position of the box slider and then we divide it by 15 in order to get the correct increments and then we add 39 to get the correct range that we want and then we also have this floor function which takes off the decimal places for us uh, in order to add our degree symbol we need to do a few things uh, let's go back to the protopy help and we're going to scroll through here and just look at some of the examples. So they have some tutorials that you can go through. They talk about variables and variable types. Talk about syntax. I want you to look at this function or this section right here on text functions. So what this is saying is that if you add some text to some more text, it takes those two pieces of text and it writes both of them together. So hello plus world is hello world. If you have this number one and number two, but they're inside of these quotations, that means that this is text and it's going to add that one, uh, add, sorry, excuse me, add that two to the one, right? And just give you one two. Uh, because this is not doing a math operation, it's doing a text function. Okay, and if you do a text plus a number, it will just convert that number into text. So it just appends that to the end of the text. So let's go back to our project. And what we can do is simply add a degree symbol to this expression right here. So if I type a plus and then I type the right combination to get our degree symbol which is option shift 8. Now it's not going to like that because it doesn't know what type of thing this is. Is this a number or is it text or something else? And so in order to tell it s explicitly that this is text we wrap it inside of double quotations just like that. And now when we commit this change by tapping the checkbox and we preview we can see that that degree symbol will always be added to the end of our target temperature. It's a little bit confusing because as you can see the plus sign here means to literally add this number but the plus sign here means to just append that degree symbol to the end of our number and that's how you add a degree symbol.